The Artisan Collection by Haynes is a range of contemporary interior and exterior crafted finishes that add texture and beauty to contemporary environments. The collection features three core ranges, surface, metallics and textures. Today we will showcase how you use and apply Haynes Artisan Metallics. Artisan Metallics comprises four unique products, real copper, real iron, metal trace and matte polish. In this tutorial, we'll feature Metallic's real copper paint and oxidising patina which creates an authentic verdigris finish. Real copper paint and oxidising patina can be applied by using a variety of techniques, but to achieve this finish we used a 10mm microfiber roller and tray, a brush for cutting in, a spray bottle, gloves and safety glasses for protection and clean rags. For new surfaces, apply the recommended Haynes undercoat. Two coats of real copper paint are required before the application of oxidising patina. Before you begin, we recommend that you practice the application technique on a large sample board. For every great project, preparation is vital to achieve the desired look. Mask up all edges with Haim's 14 day tape. This allows the application tool to press into the edges without affecting the adjoining ceiling, walls or trim. Mix real copper paint thoroughly with a paint stirrer. Using a brush and the 10mm roller, cut in and roll two coats of real copper paint, allowing two hours to dry between each coat. Before applying the oxidising patina, to avoid skin contact, we recommend the use of disposable or rubber gloves and eye protection. Floor protection such as plastic and absorbent drop sheets is also important. Oxidising patina can be applied in many ways to achieve varying results. It's only limited by your imagination. Gently rotate the oxidising patina to mix and pour into a spray bottle. For this application, spray the oxidising patina liberally over the entire wall. Break up the streams of product by either dabbing or throwing a clean cotton rag at the wall. If the patina is too thick to spray, dilute slightly with water. The verdigris finish will begin to appear almost instantly. Allow to dry and develop for at least two hours. Then dilute the oxidising patina with water to enable a finer spray and fill in any areas that may have been missed previously. For a more subtle washed out finish, dilute the oxidising patina with a ratio of up to 80% water to 20% oxidising patina. Spray the patina and water solution over the real copper paint and then gently drag a soft cloth over the surface. Leave for 24 hours for the finish to develop. To seal and protect, apply one coat of natural clear matte with a 15mm microfiber roller. The Artisan Collection by Haynes. Perfect imperfection.